Hello guys, welcome back and welcome kung bago ka sa channel na to. So yung topic naman natin yun is arithmetic series. So yung arithmetic series is uh, ito lang yung sum ng mga terms ng arithmetic sequence. Okay? So yung formula ng arithmetic series is S sub n S sub n is equal to n over 2 times the quantity a sub 1 plus a a sub n. Okay? So, yung S sub n is yung sum ng mga terms. Yung n is yung number of terms, kung ilang terms yung inaad natin. A sub 1 is yung first term, and yung A sub n is yung last term. So, for example, find the sum of the integers from 1 to 50. So, i-add daw natin yung mga integers from 1 to 50. So, first term natin is 1, then 2, then 3, hanggang 50. Okay? Okay? So, yung A sub 1 natin dito is 1. And then, yung A sub N natin, yung last term, that is 50. So, A sub 50 siya kasi, kasi meron tayong 50 terms. Okay? Meron tayong 50 numbers. So, meron tayong 50 na numbers from 1 to 50. Okay? So, A sub 50 siya. Now, gamitin natin yung formula para makuha natin yung sum. So, S sub N... So, yung n natin is 50, kasi 50 lahat ng numbers na i-add natin. So, s sub 50 is equal to n over 2, n natin is 50, 50 over 2, times a sub 1, that is 1, plus a sub n, which is 50. a sub 50 natin. Okay? Then, simplify. 50 divided by 2, that is 25. So, 1 plus 50, that is 51. Then, 25 times 51. So, 51 times 25. 5, 25, 2, 10. 5, 7, 2, 1. So, therefore, the answer is 1,275. Okay? So, yung sum ng numbers from 1 to 50 is 1,275. And for example, number 2 natin. Find the sum of the first 25 terms of the arithmetic sequence 4, 9, 14, 19, and so on. So, yung arithmetic sequence natin is 4, 9, 14, 19, and so on. So, pinapasolve sa atin yung sum na first 25 terms. Ibig sabihin, inahanap natin yung S sub 25, kasi 25 terms. So, gamitin lang natin yung formula. So, n natin is 25. So, 25 over 2 times A sub 1 times A sub 1. A sub 1 natin is 4 plus A sub 25, kasi 25 terms. Ay, hindi pa natin alam yung A sub 25. So, solve muna natin. Gamit ang formula ng arithmetic sequence. So, A sub n is equal to A sub 1 plus n minus 1 times D. Okay? So, A sub 1 natin is 4. So, inahanap natin si A sub 25 plus n natin is 25. 25 minus 1 times common difference. So, common difference, A sub 2 minus A sub 1 lang. Or a sub 3 minus a sub 2. So 9 minus 4, that's 5. So we derive 14 minus 9, 5. Okay, so 5 yung common difference natin. And then, simplify lang natin. 4 plus 25 minus 1, that is 24. And then, 24 times 5, that is 20, 120. So 120. 120 plus 4, that is 124. So therefore, so therefore, yung ating A sub 25 is 1, 2, 4. So palitan na natin tong A sub 25 natin ng 1, 2, 4. So what? A sub 25 is 1, 2, 4. Then simplify natin. So 25 over 2 times 1, 2, 4 plus 4. That's 1, 2, 8. Okay? Then 1, 2, 8 divided by 2. That is 64. Times 25, so 64 times 25, that is 20, 32, 8, 12, 0, 0, 
So therefore, S sub 25 is 1,600. Okay? And for the last example natin, find the sum of the numbers between 1 and 81 which are divisible by 4. So, i-add daw natin yung mga numbers na divisible by 4 from 1 up to 81. Okay? Yung mga divisible by 4 lang. So, dahil divisible by 4 lang yung i-add natin, so, tanggalin na natin itong 1, 2, 3. Kasi hindi naman siya divisible by 4. So, therefore, yung A sub 1 natin is 4. And then, yung last term natin is, hindi nakasali yung 81. So, 80. Kasi hindi naman divisible by 4 yung 81. Okay? So, ito yung A sub 1 natin. Ito yung A sub n natin. So, hindi natin alam kung pangilang term yung 80. Kaya A sub n lang. So, solve muna natin si n gamit ang formula ng arithmetic sequence. So, a sub n is equal to a sub 1 plus n minus 1 times c. So, i solve natin si n. Now, may a sub n na tayo. That's 80. Then, a sub 1 natin is 4 plus n natin. So, ito yung inarap natin. Hindi natin alam si n. And then, yung common difference. Now, dahil yung now dahil divisible by 4 yung mga terms natin. So, next term natin is plus 4 lang. 8. Then, plus 4, 12, and so on. So, yung common difference natin is 4 lang kasi divisible by 4 sila. Okay? 4 plus 4 is 8, 8 plus 4 is 12. So, 4 yung common difference. Okay? Lipat natin tong 4 sa kabila so may hindi negative. And then, distribute natin si 4. 4 times n, that is 4n. 4 times negative 1, that is negative. And simplify natin to. 80 minus 4, that is 76. And then, lipat natin tong negative 4, magiging positive. Then, 4n na lang yung matitira. 76 plus 4, that is 80. And then, divide natin ng 4 para n na lang yung matira. So, cancel yung 4. Therefore, n is equal to 80 divided by 4, that is 20. So, 20 yung n natin. Ibig sabihin, yung 80 is... 28 terms siya. A sub 20. So, isa, alam na natin na A sub 20 ito. Now, gamitin na natin yung formula ng arithmetic series para masolve natin yung sum ng numbers from 4 to 80 na mga divisible by 4. So, eight. So S sub 20. Kasi 20 terms lahat yung i-add natin. So, L natin is 20. So, 20 over 2 times A sub 1 which is 4 plus a sub 20, which is 80. Okay? So, 20 divided 2, that is 10. 80 plus 4, that is 84. So, 84 plus 10, that is 840. So, therefore, so, therefore, the answer is 840. Okay? Kung meron kayo mga problems na related sa topic natin, comment below lang para matulungan mo kayo. Comment below rin kung nakatulong yung video nito. Thank you for watching and uh, huwag nyo kalimutang i-like yung